My name is Yvonne Bates and I live in Atlanta, Georgia. So not too far from you guys, um, from your location in Tennessee. I am, um, I'm hoping that you guys will consider me for one of your transformations or your projects. Uh, I have some video of the area that I like that you do and it is my, um, one of my closets. I have two, I have the best husband who allows me to have <laughs> both closets in the master bedroom all to myself. I, I have one that's my summer, uh, spring and summer closet and one that is my um, fall and winter closet. And my spring and summer closet is the one where I find myself the majority of the time. Uh, so that one is the one as we're gearing up for summer, wanting to just make sure that it gets in the best shape that it can. And uh, I'm gonna need your help to do it. So. Last year, uh, with the quarantine, I know that lots of people were uh, having home projects where they went in and got everything organized, and um, they, you know, were working through closets and pantries and, and all of that. And uh, this was the spot where I kept thinking all along that I was going to go in and just make sure that it was, you know, just like I wanted it and cleaned out and fresh. And it just didn't happen. And I think that one of those reasons is because um, I'm a school teacher, I've been teaching for 20 years, and uh, ultimately my kids have had all of my attention and all of my emotion and passion um, lately. And so there are things like this closet have been on the back burner for a while. So uh, yeah. So normally I'm very organized, very organized, and at school I'm very organized, my closets and everything so that I know exactly where it is, but, um, but again, this project has been one that after teaching all day and coming home um, and even on weekends or spring break and, and as I mentioned all through the time whenever we were quarantined, um, it just didn't happen. It didn't happen. So I would go into my closet and I would look at it briefly and walk right out and say, nope, I'm gonna save that for another day. Now, along the way, I have, um, as I was watching you guys and being inspired, I have gone in and I have done the quick picks of, okay, well, I'm never gonna wear that again or I haven't worn that in ages. And so I have uh, donated and um, gotten and then trashed some things that just were, you know, no longer needed. Um, but it still is just a hot mess. And so, um, like I said, most of my time and energy has been spent uh, in putting into my kiddos. So I moved up, I was teaching third grade and I moved up with those guys to fourth grade this year so that they had some certainty, so that they had some things that they were familiar with, some things that didn't change, um, that they could rely on in such an unreliable situation that we were all in. And so, I have half of my class face to face and half of my class on the computer screen that I teach every day. And um, it's been quite a challenge. I have learned a lot about myself, a lot about teaching, and um, and the kids have learned a lot about me. We've, we've been managing as best we can in this just crazy situation that we've been in. So I'm so proud of them. But, um, but some of my home projects have definitely gone on the back burner, and this is the main one. So, take a look. So ladies, this is the closet that I would be interested in you guys coming and giving your inspiration and tips and just all out organizational tools so that I could then take it up on myself to continue. So. Um, you'll notice it is a hot mess. This is the spring and summer closet and I have bags and clothes and workout clothes and shoes um, all here. I've tried to do some organizing with some little put together things from Target. <laughs> I have the um, you know, plastic bins over here, but you'll notice that like it's just things that are piled on top of that as well. I have my sentimental boxes at the top, which I started about, I want to say 10 years ago. You'll notice there are videos up there. I don't even know if I have anything that will play those videos anymore. Um, I even did a somewhat 
that rainbow. I put some things together by color and have kept it that way for the most part up top. Um, down at the bottom, it hasn't exactly stayed that way. But um, yeah, it is a wreck. And every time I try to come in here to organize, I just get completely overwhelmed. So I am definitely in need of a revamp here and just a life change here. And I think that that could be what you guys provide me with. So that's it. Thank you for your consideration. I hope I'll be hearing from you. And if not, I look forward to seeing you on the new season. Bye.